David C. Rockers, you must be mistaken. It's now, it's here. Come on down here and help us. David, David C. Paranormal existence. You mean to say you came here publicly? The first move and the great conspiracy had been made. Go. We're now recording. Uh, uh, if, if we do like a phone call, this one, um, well, I'll ring you. I'll ring you. You're in the office and I'll ring you now. Okay, you ready? Cool. Do, 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 do. Hello? Do. Hello, Mike. Hello? Hello, Mike. Is that Mike? Yeah, speaking. Who's this? It's John Kachagugu of uh, Two Shy Eye to Eye Enterprises. How are you today, Mike? <laughs> <laughs> Uh, I prefer to see you eye to eye, to be honest, John. Well, I, I'd love to get in uh, contact and see you eye to eye, but we have, we're having a few problems. South Africa's gone tits. Um, it looks like David has, um, he's, he's, he's actually ripped one of his ass cheeks off uh, using a pair of scissors. The whole deal's gone to shit, but we might be able to fix it on Thursday. Are you available for golf, Mike? Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> It's just a strong oh, intro. A strong, it's a strong intro. I was going to say strong, the same thing. John Kachagugu, Hush Hush Eye yeah. to Eye Enterprises, straight in yeah. there. It gets the younger crowd in. They know the pop stars, you know. Lamar Incorporated, as I call them. Y- yeah. Um, weirdly, I was just saying, just before you just click record then, you do that brilliant intro. Yeah. Uh, I can't think of another podcast I've ever been involved with where I can sit down, um, drink wine from a bottle, <laughs> And just make fart noises for an hour. It's, it's so liberating, isn't it? And the freedom. Oh. <laughs> really <is. laughs> oh. <laughs> it really is oh, fucking it is. terrible. It really, it really is. It's such a low <laughs> quality fucking pilot shit. <laughs> really I'm getting hot already. It's just a mishmash yeah, of yeah. complete uh, shit, you know. You get these people doing yeah. fucking, I don't know, podcasts about car tires mm. or, I don't know, buying a rug or, you know, oh, something well, like that. It's, every it's, prick on their uncle does that, yeah. It's absolute, it's absolute crap, you know. Oh, I'm into yeah. swimming outdoors oh. and I'm going swimming outdoors. Ooh, look at me. Yeah. You know, what, why? Listen to, What's the yeah. point? Yeah. 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 I mean, I want to yeah. I, I, I get deep into this idea of pushing a rather... Do you, want to, <laughs> real ale? Do you want to talk about real ale and fucking <laughs> walking around the country? No, I don't want to talk about that. Fuck off. No. I've got better things I, to do. I want the real deal. Although, although, I, I although want... actually, I, I always say I've got better things to do, but I don't do anything better than that ever. No. And and that's the so key yeah, to it. I think. I'm sure know, there's better things I should do, but I don't actually do them. <laughs> What do you mean? There's better things than talking about, you know, making a device to hurt your own bottom, farting, yeah. doing stupid yeah. voices. Perfect. Yeah. You know? Yeah. I'm just having a can of Heineken. We're really going to go for I just this said week. To my missus, no, I've got to, I've got to, I've got to go to. I'm working tonight. <clears> she <throat> said, she said, making farting noises and, and talking about Dukovny is not work. That's what she said. <laughs> well, it, you know, we're not getting paid for this, so in many ways she's <laughs> right. Does no more else, more elbow. What are you talking about? That's not getting white. That's freaking work. <laughs> Pulling your ass apart in front of a mirror is a hard goddamn job, kid. <laughs> Yeah. Well, back in the day, that's all there was, wasn't it? You know, back yeah. in the grandparents' day. The 14th century. Christ, you know, my, gra- my granddad was pulling his ass apart at 14 years of age back in those days. I mean, look at your great-grandparents, you know, pushing pebbles up Different there time. just to make a couple of bob. Unbelievable. Yeah, <laughs> just a couple of bob. On the old Graveling. That's what they used to you call know. it. That's what they, 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 these days they will call, you know, if, if someone's, you know, if you, if someone's a bit, oh, yeah. a bit of a, bit of a slant, they call them a groveling bastard. Whereas it's actually, um, it's, it's evolved from the term groveling bastard when people would place bits of pebbles, uh, loose rock, t- mm. dust from cement into the bottom. And the pain mm. would be so great. They'd roll around on the floor going, please, please, a penny for my anus, you know, and it would, it would built from there. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I love this podcast. That's good, though. <clears throat> it is good. Fantastic. What do you think of saying Chon on the uh, on the Zencaster, not John? Well, that that, uh, that actually goes back to the uh, right back to the uh, moderately successful Z List uh, pop group that I'm in. Uh, Chon Benoit Balls is one of my alter egos. Oh, right. Okay. I and I, I also went to school with a young lad who, who couldn't say the J of John, and he used to call me Chon. Oh, okay. Right, Chon. Yeah. yeah. Not not bad. Not bad. Yeah. Yeah. So. Again, that's filled yeah. up uh, 28 seconds well, or so. Continue. Need half a minute, virtually, isn't it? Yeah, not bad. You know, the people I'm at the school with a lad who uh, 
who used to try and pick himself up in a bag. <laughs> I, 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 I've, I've, tried, <laughs> I've tried. I have tried that with a rope. Um, st- yeah. st- standing on a rope. I no, guess he was inside the, the bag. He was just, he used to stand in a kit bag and try to pick himself up, yeah. He was called right. Mooncat. It wasn't his real name, but that was what we all called him. Was he the lad who sang it? It's the Yum Yum. Mm. No, that was Robert Dutton. This is mm. this is the Yum Yum. Yeah. <laughs> this is the Yum Yum. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah, no, he, he was the lad who uh, masturbated in science lessons. Oh, there's always one in there. There's always We one. had a kid. It, primary school used to expose his we ball bag under the table. Uh, 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 yeah. yeah. Sorry, John, I didn't know what you were saying. There's always a slight delay. Say that again. It's, I just saying, it was a lad in primary school used to, um, during lunch, uh, he would uh, sit at the table whilst we we're having sandwiches and he classic oh. line, look at this. And he would just get yeah. the ball bag out and show yeah, us always. that. Moved on now, yeah. of course. I don't know where he is. He could be He could be dead now. I suppose we can't be now, isn't he? <laughs> well, hang on a minute. I'm having some wind. I've just had that can of lager. Hang on. Go on and have a little uh, bit. It's gone. It's bit. gone. I'm drinking... Like I said, as I mentioned, I'm drinking wine, wine from the bottle. Any reason tonight? Nice celebrating? Or? Not really, not particularly. Um, because I can't usually do that when I work. I, I can't usually drink when I do when I do other work. Again, it looks so like I don't have a lot of time. But with, with this, I can, I can, I could literally yeah. be paralytic. It would make no difference whatsoever. This fucking <clears> no. Shit, I mean, if anything, the the sort <laughs> of fart noises. <laughs> oh yeah, the fart noises would be better. But, you know, that's what it's all about. Get yourself loose, free and easy on the highway of life. Really get those oh, juices flowing. Yes, That's what it's all about. We'll, uh, we'll, we'll do some voices so in a bit. We're doing it. Yeah, no rush. No rush. No, no rush I, I like to build up to it. You know, it's very much like using the toilet. You just, you, you can't just go at any time of the day. Nothing will come out. You'll hemorrhage and the, there could be blood. Just, just let it build. Let it. And a prolapse anus is a friend of no man, is it? No, I mean, you, you don't want that. You don't want. You don't even want like a partial lip coming out the side. Good friend of mine had um, terrible hemorrhoids, oh. and it, he described. I said, you know, what's what, what's it like your hemorrhoids? And he mm. all he did was mm. he folded his the top lip of his mouth over the bottom lip, and he said it looks like that. And I knew straight away what he was. Okay. <laughs> what he was talking. Nice yeah. What he's talking about. Yeah. He, he went to the doctors because um, he had stomach oh. and anus problems. Yeah. And uh, they paid a bit of money to put a camera in his bot bot, but also into his, oh. his mouth. And mm. obviously he was unconscious when they did it. Mm. Um, but what was wonderful was when he was coming out of, out of the process, he was lying mm. on the bed and they were just removing the camera. And you know when you were a bit woozy when he came out of it and he was going, oh, oh yeah. Uh, I'm pulling yeah. myself. I'm pulling myself. I prove my- and they go no yeah. no it's all right we've yeah. done it now it's finished i, I, I prove it myself because he no, wasn't yeah. he just had a vhs camera up his bottom and that would feel the same there is nothing worse though like when not this never happened to me but when someone's finger in your bum yeah uh it's not, when they take not. the finger out of your bum yeah and this could be it's- a doctor it could be a priest it doesn't matter who it is but i mean <laughs> well, <laughs> you do feel like you pooed yourself don't you yeah, it's, the, ah, you call know, you out. Ah. If if you're gonna put something up your bottom, <laughs> put something up mm. there that doesn't come back out like a marble. Because then once it's up there, it won't come back down again. So you're fine. You know, get, oh. get a bag of marbles. Get a rubber bag tube. Of marbles, yeah. Yeah. Rubber tube, bag of marbles. One one end in the mouth, the other end in the other mouth. Pop the marbles yeah. in and <laughs> straight in. You're laughing. Like a, like a, what they call it, blow dart. Like a blow. Yeah. Like blow yeah. football, like blow football, except it's marbles and it's going up your anus, not a goal. Yes. I used to have a theory yeah. as a child. You, you you may be familiar with the uh, the tooth fairy. Obviously, it comes along at night. Uh, it takes mm. your loose teeth. It leaves a pound under the bed. I, yeah. <laughs> I had a theory about the itchy bum theory, uh, itchy bum fairy. Okay. Uh, what the itchy bum fairy used to do. Not the sugar, I mean, not the sugar, plum, not the sugar plum fairy. No, this is the uh, itchy bum fairy. I'm more of a sort of scratchy, oh, okay. scr- scratchy blood bum fairy. When you've okay. everyone's had a stingy ring, I don't care who you are, where you're from, you, you cannot deny. Oh, everyone's doesn't matter. Prince ring. or pauper, everyone's had that. Yeah, um, everyone what, from what, the, what from I the used highest to, high to the lowest low. What I what I used to believe would happen would would be a sort of a man in a sort of cloth sack, probably in his sort of late sixties, almost quite Lord of the Rings looking, would creep into yeah. your bedroom at night, or, or, he, or would it be more like? 
Uh, was it Patrick Troughton in uh, in the Box of Delights? In yeah, box yes, of Delights. That's there you about, go. Yeah? There you go. The shit box of delights, yeah. we can call it. Yeah, right. yeah. So basically, the Patrick Troughton. Right? Mm. Patrick Troughton from the shit box of delights. In my Creep shit into box you. are such delights. <clears throat> yeah. Again, the kids remember this, this was. I was a big fan of that when I was eleven, thirty-eight yeah. years ago. The younger kids are going to go wild for this. Uh, the idea of Troughton comes into your bedroom. He takes the light bulb out of his socket, crushes some of the glass into a fine powder, then mm. gets a metal tube, pops the glass in the tube, yep. places it into the anus and <laughs> blows it in. When you wake up the next day, stinging cut ring. Oh, That's right. what it's all about. That's what it's all oh, about. Nice. The mashed up, oh, mashed well, up well, Lovely wife just bought me a lovely mug of coffee. Thank, thank you, Cal. God bless you. So you've got lovely a mixture person. of... She's, uh, she's a lovely wine. person. Wine from the bottle and uh, drinking wine there. and coffee now, John. It's uh, you know you've heard of, you've heard of uh, Irish Irish coffee, yeah. A little bit of whiskey in, in your coffee, yeah. I'm drinking French coffee, a uh, cup Lovely. of coffee with some white wine in it. <laughs> Lovely. The um, what was it going to? Oh, the uh, paranormal content is going AF as fuck this yeah. week. Oh, um, what is, come on, tell me. <laughs> it's going right through the roof gonna say gonna save it i, I don't want to i don't want to peek too soon but i've i've well let's just say i've experienced something this week firsthand and i'm really going through the roof with this so uh let's uh let's just hold on for a guess bit what there. i'm so chuffed at i just just googled i wasn't i wasn't ignoring you but can, I just hang on, can i can i just have the guest can, can i have the guest Go on. Go you on went on for a shit and when you wiped it was clean no 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 <laughs> okay i uh googled Box of Delights, and it was Patrick Troughton. I wasn't, I wasn't imagining it. Yeah, it was, it was, was Troughton. It? Yeah, you are right. Yeah. Um, Tr- it's great Troughton was all, also responsible for scary, though, wasn't it? Well, the box of Delights, shit box of Delights and stuff. And... Yeah, it's not natural, is it? <clears throat> you wouldn't yeah. have that going on uh, on my neck of the woods. No, no. It's strictly business. Any old men that They're came around my neck of the woods, you know, we'd slash them, destroy them. I'm just going to, hang on a minute. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. Oh, yeah. I wish you. I wish the inside of your stomach. Huh? <laughs> what was that? You know, that was some standard job. Sorry about that. <clears throat> Sorry, I, I like, like to draw. Spoiler alert on before that or something. I do enjoy a can of lager at high speed just before we begin the episode, and quite often it will build up. You never can do. Yeah, just to get the old juices flowing. Um, it oh. hasn't started yet. They, they will be flowing soon. I'm having yeah. a lovely drop of white wine. Yeah. What flavour is the wine? Big up my friend who makes Paso Primero white wine. Lovely. I bet your mate, yeah. what they actually do is just buy a bottle from Tesco and then pour it into another bottle. Sell it. <laughs> you might, I mean, he might do that. Uh, but he seems like a nice fella, so I doubt it. Oh, that's the thing. Uh, it could be deceptive. The, uh, Remember the, the French back someone. in the day putting the old... Uh, uh, well, they put antifreeze in wine. Remember the eighties? Yes, God, are you talking? Yeah. I mean, the kids are going to love this. Br- brings me round to <laughs> yeah. Remember that uh, great days. Eps- only early fools 80s. and horses. Four early eighties. Yeah, I mean, classic references. Yeah. Classic references. Goose green. Uh, Mark Thatcher, Maggie Thatcher's son, getting lost driving a car through the desert again. Yeah. The kids will go nuts for that. Margaret Absolutely. Thatcher, prime minister of the country, thirty odd years ago, been dead for ages. Uh, her yeah. son. Yep. Yeah. Mark, yeah. Tried to, see, well, he got lost on the, was it the yeah, Paris the Pari- Dakar Pari- rally? Paris Dakar rally, I believe. Yeah. 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 And then, of course, I'm he tried sure to start a war. No, nothing at all, but it's great for the younger listeners. It's really but strong. It's it's strong. Totally, it fills the time, John. Yeah. I mean, yeah, this is the thing about you talk about uh, the Thatchers. Uh, you know, uh, divided, very much divided opinion, you know. So uh, the best thing about a debate, of course, if you're doing a podcast, it has to la- last a certain amount of time. Uh, debates, uh, by their very nature, engender discussion, and discussion takes time, and time is uh, time is very literally money, John, you know. So, yeah, uh, literally. I mean, I mean, you, you look at someone like Thatcher, she was an incredibly powerful woman. Oh, she had the ability Thatcher, to invent salt scoop ice cream. She had a son that Ooh, disappeared in a car during a rally. 
She'd refuse to sit down during working hours. The woman would never sit down. For many years, people thought this was an incredibly strong mm. work ethic that she tried to portray on the yes. country, encouraging people to work, 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 and make their own money, when in reality she was suffering from a severe case of smashed-up shitbox syndrome after Patrick Troughton <laughs> broke into her bedroom with a rubber pipe late one night, crushed a light bulb, oh. and blew the glass deep into oh. her anus. She was too Good ashamed, box, too nice. ashamed to admit it, and indeed ended up dying because of a ruptured anus. Unbelievable <laughs> for Maggie Thatcher. <laughs> and of course, Dennis took the, the, uh, the secret to his grave. Uh, but you know, it was very, very, very fair bad. Dennis, he died before, <laughs> so... It is incredibly brave, but he in fact took his own life uh, because he was so ashamed of uh, Thatcher's ring piece, <laughs> matched by the the, the 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 glass that was blown in by 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 yes. Patrick. Oh, yes, he was so incredibly ashamed. He decided to cut his own nipples off and bled himself to death in the bath. Well, was the thing about up. Trouters, the thing about Trouters was Trouters was apolitical. He wasn't like he wasn't anti. He wasn't anti anybody particularly. He was no, no, it's very true. much a man of the world. He was a he was a he was a man of means. Uh, he was a man who liked to explore, Johnny. Liked to experiment, and uh, indeed, his particular peccadillo was uh, was crushed glass of the anus. You know, it was, it was nothing to do with Thatcherism, nothing to do with uh, uh, capitalism. It was nothing to do with with the uh, with the Falklands conflict. It was purely because Troughton liked to do things differently, John. Indeed, and th th there was no reason to want to stop him doing it. In fact, when he played Doctor Who, the only reason he was taken off of the show was because of the fact that every time they shot an episode, he was taking down the lamps, the lighting, the light bulbs in the staff room and smuggling them home for his own collection, which was not a problem until the BBC completely ran out of light bulbs and, of course, were plunged into darkness. Uh, incredibly, they were all found inside Troughton's anus uh, a few months later. Uh, they were returned with a letter of apology, but of course he could never play Doctor Who again. Uh, it's incredibly sad. He's British, John. I mean, uh, but, uh, you know, he moved on. Yeah, and people do move yeah. on. You know, you, yes. your life is a series of events, a series of uh, cause and effect. And, uh, of course, by, by, uh, by doing that, then Troughton realised that it was time to move on, John. You know, Indeed. He, he moved on from, from Doctor Who and moved on to uh, to, to the Box Street Lights, uh, and, uh, and I don't know what else he did, really. I mean, very, is, he, is he alive? I mean, is, is Trouble alive? I don't know. There, there, there are rumours that he runs a skip hire company on the outskirts of Peterborough now, but people, people just don't like to, 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 to delve too deeply into this man's... It was a very private life, whereas you look at Tom Baker or Peter Davidson or any of the other characters who, who portrayed Doctor Who, they were very open about what they did with light bulbs and broken glass and, 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 and rubber tubes, you see. Incredible. Yes, I just see that Troughton died in 1987, so... Um, of course, he, 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 for tax purposes he did, but we all know quite... Of quite um, sure, yeah, man, of course. You, you can't, can't be sued, of course, because mm. dead, dead men can't sue. That's the old saying. Of course. So, uh, we can say what we like about the family, so but we also know that he does still live to this day and runs a very, very specialist company known as Pipe Rubber Tube Master. And if you do contact on the internet, he can feed... Broken glass, pebbles, anything you like into the anus for a small fee. And he's doing quite well. Oh, course, so. oh. Hot meat, German, £4.50 a go. Come on, roll up, <laughs> pop it in, boys. Nice and hot. <laughs> Tasty. Lovely. Mm. Wonderful, wonderful. Great, great man, a great raconteur and a, and a wonderful uh, anus smith, if you will. <laughs> Somebody Again, who works that, I mean, that... anus. You know. Yeah. That's filled up, what, a good four, four oh, minutes? Was, two or three minutes, that was easy. That's, that's two, strong, strong that was. I should... Uh, well, just, I should listen to this. You got, what you got to bear in mind, John, yeah. with this particular podcast, is the, the, the fucking low standard of listener that listens to this. Yeah, I mean, you know... They've got literally you, fuck all better to do. That's why they listen yeah. to it, so don't worry about it. You know... No, not at all. I mean, it's, are, it's just I'm, I'm more. I'm, they're clag. They're, they're clag. Their life's clag. Yeah, this, yeah, the scudge. Yeah. I mean, I'm more worried about filling up my own time because I've got an hour to kill. Mm. I want to make sure I'm, I'm doing something during that time. And you know, I think that's only right. I yeah, it's only right. Yeah. Um, yeah. I, I will get around to doing some some voices with you. You know, we've done some already, so we'll we'll do some. Oh, more just some voices then. afterwards. Yeah. <laughs> 
We'll do the old fellas again because that's easy to do, isn't it, for us? I like the old fellas, yeah. They they go down yeah, a tree. Good lads. Good yeah, couple of lads. We'll probably, we'll probably do uh, some blokes in the Bronx talking about Johnny Wiseman or at some point. We'll do, well, he, I'd, imagine, do I'd imagine Steptoe and Son. And then we'll yep, throw hello, hello. And just, just be, um, oh, hello, hello. We haven't done a little for a while. We'll bang that in. I'll do the grand. I'll use the grand. Yeah, I love, I love um, the grand. Big fan of the grand. Yeah, yeah, she's great. She's yeah, what, great. What, what else can we do in the, in the meantime? Here you go. The what kids, did you... Love, um, the kids love this. Oh, they go wild for it. Absolutely wild. Have you eaten anything today? That's a good topic. We could go into that. Here we go. Uh, what oh, have you I had to that. eat? Great. This is a great topic. Yeah, here we go. Great topic, on, this. this. This is okay. going to go viral, this. Yeah. What, I had what a mini had pork to... pie. Smash that like button straight in, yeah. Yeah, and then uh, smash like and subscribe if you like people who have had four fish sticks as well today. Get it. Four fish dicks. Fish sticks. Okay. Right. If you've, yeah. um, whatever. Yeah. Um, s- hit the, smash the like button if you, if you like that. Um, I had a bag of popcorn uh, next to a hospital. <laughs> Wicked. So if you like, if you like, smash like on that. Smash and like that. I had, some, I had some grapes that were left over in the fr- back of the fridge. Yeah. Subscribe to that. Um, and then I had some, just had some noodles with some stir fry. We didn't have any meat to go in there. So just the noodles and stir fry. That was fucking disappointing. Yeah. Smash um, and like, son. Smash and, smash and like for that. And then I had a mull of fruit corner with it. Should I, should I do What's mine now? Right today? Okay. Oh, yeah, please, yeah. And I watched Cool Runnings as uh, well, of course. Class. Good film. Uh, yeah. So far today, I've smashed and liked a hot cup of coffee. Uh, oh, hit, that, hit, of, hit that like button if you like that. Hit that like button on that straight off. Um, yeah. Subscribe to uh, Two Bits of Toast with Peanut Butter, or I like to call it Hashtag Penis Butter. Two Bits of Toast. Straight off. Penis Butter. Um, midday crunchy then we were... Uh, crunchy. 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 Hashtag smooth. Hashtag, Hashtag crunchy. crunchy. Straight in okay. there midday, I was hitting up the um, uh, high def uh, full length upload of uh, a cup of soup, uh, asparagus cup of lols. soup, two bits of toast, mega lols. No, oh, good stuff. Yeah. And then uh, ended up the grand finale. Then I subscribed to a uh, uh, a defrosted ch- chicken curry that I'd made the other day. Fuck frozen off! The other half. You couldn't make it yeah. up. Fuck Fucking off! Straight off! Straight off! You know. Get off! Bare skills, bruv. You Bare had skills. a fucking chicken curry, my ass. Oh, my days, bruv. You get me? I was, like, eating yeah. a curry and all that, you know? <laughs> <laughs> like, he had the curry, you get me? But I was, like, frozen, live. right? Isn't it live? You get me, bruv. Serious, you know? I was, like, eating yeah. that curry and all that, you know, wicked, uh, bruv. Yeah. If, do you know if I try and join in with this particular accent, I'll just sound like a racist, so I'll let you get on with it. Okay, yeah, well, we'll, we'll so just I'm move not on. racist. So. I'll end up doing a very bad Rastafarian, and then no one's happy. <laughs> Yeah, you, you don't you know you don't want to go too far with this. You know that's what it's, that's what it's all about. No woman, no cry. <laughs> no woman, no cry. <laughs> I mean that is my inner city London. Just just singing it in a straight manner turns you into a racist. There's no doubt of that. Yeah, I just straight, like the song. It's a great song. Um, I yeah. might. What I might do, right? I, I might go feel get another the rhythm, can. Feel the ride. Hold on tight. <laughs> it's bobsled time. Cool runnings. I was watching that today. Loving life. John Candy, of course. Okay. Great. John uh, real Candy. name John Sweets, uh, originally Canadian. <laughs> <laughs> Ch- changed his name for show business, but uh, yeah. a wonderful man. Fuck Absolutely. Wonderful man. Very, Very big lump man. of a man. Um, I'm just going to get another unit. can. It's a big do, you mind if I, do you mind if I go and get another can? Could you sort of sing no, us? Yeah, I might just, you... We could do a pissed with today. I'm, I'm getting quite merry now. I've drank a half a bottle of white wine from the bar. Let's get loose. So I'll go juice, get... lads. I might introduce. <laughs> Let's do it. I'm sorry, I'm just gonna, let, me, let me go and get my can now. You all, you just sing for a bit. Do a Johnny Matthews song. No, I'm going to get another. No, I'm not doing another. I'm going to get a drink. <laughs> Let's can go get a drink. Some music in here a minute. Reece, can you can you, can you still hear us at the moment, Reese? Reese, you there? Yeah. What's up? Okay. Can, just can, make can some, we just make a noise or whistle for a bit while I'm going to go and get a drink and John's getting. People's going to get drinks. So He's going to go and get drinks. Yeah. So could you just do like thirty seconds max? What prayers? Hang on, Reese. What prayers can you remember from school? Um, the Lord's Prayer. I can barely. I'll try. Okay. You, you well, try. Okay. Go, I'll go get a can. Start now. Go. 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 Our, our <laughs> Father who uh, art in uh. heaven, um, hallow be thy name. Uh, thy will no. Uh, thy will be. Hallow be thy name. 
Thy kingdom come. <laughs> thy kingdom come. Will be done. Have you done it? Is that it? Yeah. On earth as it is in heaven. Uh, as it is in heaven. Heaven. Give us, be, give us this give us, day our daily give bread. Our daily bread. Give us our trespasses. Be thy give name. those who trespass against us. Trespassing. Who? Lead, us, lead us not into temptation. Lead us not into temptation. But deliver from us from evil. evil. Oh, the end. And then yeah. we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. If, if, if you're, uh, if you're agnostic or an atheist or of another religion, that was not a reflection. Reflection. anything other than 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 uh, uh, a filler. And yeah, got a quiet time for reflection. Wonderful. Yeah, I like to think. Let's all, just all get on. Yeah, all have a and good time. And if we can bring time. people together, then brilliant. <laughs> you know. Come ah. on. This is a best every podcast woman, ever. every man, join, join the caravan. caravan. Stand up. Stand, Stand up. up. Wonderful. See? That's good. Do you know why? Yeah. What the world needs now is love, sweet love. It's the only thing that there's just too little of. Isn't it? Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Yeah. Are you having a straw with that wine today? You're... Well, I'm just about finishing this bottle now. Then I'm going to. Um, I got gin and tonic in a can. I got a. a, a I call it my Diane Abbott special. Oh, classic! Go on, son. That Kids will be loving the Diane Abbott references on the tube. Yeah, I mean that's that's a bit more modern, so they'll they'll be they'll be on top of that, you know. Um, if you like Diane Abbott, smash like and subscribe. Yeah, smash like and subscribe. You if know? you dislike Diane Abbott, we're, we're yeah. open to anyone here. Whatever your politics, yeah. whatever you've never heard beliefs. of Diane Abbott. Come on. Smash like and subscribe. Yeah. Do, if if you're just Googling Diane Abbott now, smash like and subscribe, then come back, tell us who she is, and then smash like and subscribe on top. You know? Great yeah. stuff. Have we even got a, have we got a YouTube channel? Reese, have we got a YouTube what? channel? Reece, yeah. yeah YouTube every, every episode auto posts to YouTube. So we get it, every episode is available on YouTube so, if you if you like that. It's free, yeah. Like it. Free, yeah. Free, yeah. No, they, don't, they don't pay for this. I give these press too much, to be honest. It's outrageous, isn't it? it is I can weird. delete it all just out of spite. I'll leave it on there now. <laughs> yeah, spite them. Fuck them. Yeah, spite them. Okay. Wipe it. Just wipe it. It's, it's a waste. It's just a waste of life, isn't it? You sitting there listening to that. I just, just, just make them all private. Yeah, spite yeah, make, yeah. Delete them all after the first like ten minutes. They go out. Cool. Just spite people. Yeah, that's <laughs> that's good, guys. Yeah, there we go. Oh, yeah. I'm just getting into my second cam. We the juices are going now. Like I said, paranormal as AF this week. We're really going for it. <laughs> God. I like it when I can't see you because you've got such pathetic, you, uh, what's the word I'm looking for, Wi-Fi. My computer Wi-Fi is terrible, yes. Like but I, I just en- always see myself and no one else. Well, I, I always enjoy the sort of, I you know. Just, I just sit I I you burping at a fucking black screen for an hour. Then I go back in the office. I think it adds to the magic. You know, a lot of people yeah. might be driving cars now. They might be working in an office environment, you know, all that kind of thing. And this, just these two sort of severed voices floating around the headphones will help them it gives in, people in some a, way. Gives them a, gives them a, like, it's like a beacon, isn't it? It's like a, it's like a yeah. beacon in the darkness sometimes. Yeah, that's it. You know. We're saving lives, John. That's what we're doing. Of course, they're just holding out for that final 35 seconds of the show when we, we drop the paranormal uh, as AF content on them. They will, yeah. They'll be going nuts. They'll be going absolutely nuts. But, uh, I'm actually got all the paranormal shit lined up. Are you ready to go? Are you are you ready to go on the paranormal as AF now? Or? Feel the rhythm, feel the ride, hold on tight. It's paranormal time, and then we <laughs> straight in, there. just straight in, sort of like a sort of dance hall. Because at the beginning they say they're going like eins zwei drei. They're trying to copy the Swede, the Swiss team, are they? What they on, um, um, the Jamaican way? Cool what's he called? Yeah, I've never actually seen it. You've never seen Cool Runnings? Never seen it. Never seen it. I think they tried to show it to us in school on the last day. He just gave up on that, walked out. Yeah. Um, of course, the original never... star, Johnny Weismuller. <laughs> Don't talk to me about Weismuller. That movie was a fucking... <laughs> the whole damn movie had to be recast, reshot, the whole damn thing, all because of Weismuller. You know why? Because he tried There's to... There's no way Johnny Weismuller looked like he was a Jamaican guy. They tried everything. how much making he put on. They said, Weismuller... 
change the accent, change your clothes, change the way you walk. He said, I can't, it's racist. I said, why is Muller fucking do it anyway? Why is Muller did it? He looked like a racist asshole. So you know what he did? He pushed the bobsleigh up his ass, set fire to the studio and fucked off out of there. <laughs> they never made another movie with him again. They lost a million bucks. Yeah. It wasn't until John Candy turned up some kid called John Sweets, 18 years old, said he had an idea. <laughs> the revamp this damn movie. Into the studio, this fat Canadian kid walks in, trousers round his ankles, broken glass up his ass. He looked like a fucking bum. He said, I got an idea. I'm going to revamp the whole damn movie. They left him into the fucking ground. Six years later, the kid's a fucking millionaire. <laughs> <laughs> John's Feats was the greatest 18 year old I ever met in my life. Sweets. <laughs> <laughs> he claimed he was Canadian. He claimed his real name was Candy. I got dirt on that bastard. His real name, John Sweets, the son of a bitch. He whipped off all of Vice Muller's movies, reinvented himself in the front wall, and that was it. It was a way to the stars, kid. And that bastard left Vice Muller in the dirt, weeping like a bitch. <laughs> Any of these assholes talk about Uncle Buck. I remember the original, 1933, with Johnny Vice Muller. Uncle Buck. More like Uncle Fuck. The guy was a sex machine. The kids loved that shit. That was triple X rated before there was such a rating. You couldn't put two guys in the same bed in Hollywood back in those days. You had to keep a foot on the floor in the sex scenes. Weissmuller didn't give a fuck. And okay, Uncle got... Fuck, he fucked everything. And I mean everything. <laughs> You ever hear of a movie called Canadian Bacon Kid? It goes back to the 80s. This fella, John Candy, I know him. His real name's Sweets, John Sweets, something like that. You know what he did? He ripped it straight out of Johnny Wise Muller's cold dead hair. Still hadn't even finished the script when he took it. That son of a bitch. He made over $200,000 a week off that movie. And you know what Wise Muller got? Skid marks in his pants and a pocket full of fuck all, buddy. Hey kid, did I ever tell you about the time we released that movie Spaceballs? Bullshit to John Candy. He came in here calling himself John Switch. That bitch stole it from White Muller. And you know where White Muller got it from? Freaking to Cogni. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fuck it. Oh, just a few. Of the, few. <laughs> Ooh, sh- oh. well, that's a good. That's a good. That's a good four and a half. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fuck it. Oh, 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 oh I gotta take my jumper off. Oh, oh God. God. Oh, God. Don't you even well, stop to me on planes, trains, and automobiles. That movie was called Jungles, Monkeys, and Fuckles Up a Tree. You know where he got it from? He got it straight from John Weiswiller, that son of a bitch. He even stole his first name. He stole his first name. That was damn rude. He never made a penny off it either. He just lay on the floor outside the cinema begging for money. You know what they did? They pissed on him. They pissed all over his cock and balls and face and asshole and hair and his eyes and his mouth and his ears all over the back of his pants and his shoes. He was covered in piss. <laughs> oh, oh, fuck it up. Well, of course, uh, that's Mula, I mean... Ha, 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 ha.
Fuck. Ja. Was? Bei Smuller muss er ja. Oh, it's a tough one today. <lacht> Yes, because of Weissmuller was an innovator, first and foremost, and very much uh, at the vanguard, as it were, of, the, uh, of the, the movie business in the 1930s and the, uh, the late 20s, early 40s. And uh, Weissmuller was... Uh, 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 he had a gift, Weissmuller. He had a gift for the, for the humorous. He had a gift for the, the, the appeal of the everyman. Of course, when he made the original version of, of Uncle Buck... Uh, known as uh, Uncle, Uncle Fuck in the 30s, um, it was very much pushing boundaries. You know, Weissmuller was interested in the human condition, um, not just the, the, the boners and the vaginas, but very much the psyche, what made people tick, as it were. Uh, you know, and then they, 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 that side of Weissmuller often gets brushed over. They, they think of him as, uh, as the crass, and they, 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 they throw back the, the Tarzan... Tarzan material. They throw back uh, this penchant for, uh, for for monkeys and for for hard arms. But uh, Weissmuller was uh, was a thinker first and foremost. I mean, oh, is this he, often he, gets overlooked about Weissmuller. He was an incredibly intelligent man, and a lot of people oh. mistook him just for being a very good-looking movie actor with some strong ideas. For example, the original version of Spaceballs. Uh, space testicles, as it was known, was his mm. idea. Absolutely fantastic. But outside of cinema, he did coat his own testicles in tinfoil, attach a mm. firework, and attempt to fire his penis and balls into space. Of course, it didn't work. He lost one ball and nearly bled to death outside the House of Parliament. But, but what he did was groundbreaking. Groundbreaking. He took a chance. Vice Muller took a chance. You know, you see these people, they, they, they often, you might sit there and ruminate, what, what, what would it be if I were to wrap my testicles in tinfoil and fire them at the moon? But you never actually follow through with it. Whereas Vice Muller, Vice Muller was a doer, not just a thinker. This was the beauty of Vice Muller. Hey, I think we could all agree that Vice Muller was a, a, a splendid, splendid gentleman who was left Wonderful. behind. Uh, with the advent of obviously color film and the recorded voice, <laughs> yes, yes, a bit of wind, yeah, a bit of wind. Well, of course, the thing about Vaismula when they brought in the color film of the sort of 1940s and 50s, what people didn't realize is by some quirk of genetics or birth. Weissmuller actually was black and white. He was that color. In the oh, completely black and white. So when you saw Weissmuller in a color film, be it in Technicolor or uh, Technorama or Colorama or Fucker Color, whatever it was called in those days, <laughs> Weissmuller looked as if he was in a black and white movie and the executives wanted to show they were spending the money and they thought they didn't want to be seen as cheaps or skin flints and obviously there was a race to the top. So Weissmuller was sidelined because he was black and white. This was the great tragedy of Weissmuller. If it had not been for the black and white shades of his skin, he would have lasted an another 30, 40 years. But of course, then John oh. Sweets, a.k.a. John Candy, came along and he had already the benefit of being completely the natural colour of his environment. He had the, the hue of a well, fat white uh, Canadian sweets gentleman. Was, sweets was many things, of course, but the one thing Sweets was undoubtedly, indubitably so, was actual human coloured. Indeed. Indeed. If Sweets wore think... a blue coat, it was blue. If Sweets wore a red hat, it was red. Weissmuller was not only black and white, but everything he wore became black and white. This was the great tragedy of Weissmuller. That and fucking monkeys. Of course. And the thing is with John Sweets was he was... Oh, 35, sweet. 40 years his senior, he came onto the scene, he saw what Weissmuller had done, and he simply stole his work. And it did not go noticed until 
the late 1990s, by which point it was far too late, far too late for Wiseman to make a case because by this point he was just a rotting pile of bones in the corner of a car park. It was just not possible for Wiseman to fight back. Sadly, now John Sweets, a.k.a. John Candy, has passed as well, and there is no one left to blame. There is no one left to blame but the cinema going public. And they are all bastards, all of them. They deserve to be shot. <sighs> that's, that's great because that's filled up. What? Well, that's filled loads, that is. Yeah. I've had a, can of, I've had a can of G&T in that whole time. I, like, I, just like, I just like it when I get the sweat on, you know. That's, oh, uh, there's nothing like it. There's nothing like that. That's key for me. What's it? Should we get Reese? Are you still there? Is he there? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, do, you want, do you want to wrap and do another? No, one? no, no. I, I don't. I, I, I can keep on going, but I was just going to say, do you, do you want to do another prayer? Do you want to just chuck another any other prayers? You know, um, just to, just I, to say grace. I don't know. I didn't know that one. What about like just say grace before? Oh, grace. Yes. Before say grace. Before Should I just the... give thanks for this podcast? Yeah, there we go. Do you That'd know the good. lyrics to um, Enter Sandman? And it's Sandman by Metallica. Do you know that? I do. I can find them. Just, just what you can from memory. Just, or do the riff from End of the Sandman. I, I do. Uh, say, say your prayers, little one. Don't forget my son. Yeah. To include everyone. Is yeah. it like that? Yeah. Sleep with one eye open. You know that, that kind of thing. That's it. Well, you've done. Yeah. You've you essentially done it there anyway. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Um, you couldn't do any paranormal stuff. No. There's yeah, no, yeah. Not a major but, rush, is there? What's a major rush? I mean, we don't have to rush, but we could. Um, we could. We could either stop this one here, or I'm um, do another one, or we just carry on and, and then just have give them one big one this week. What, what, what do you reckon? Do they deserve one big one? Just give a rambling I, big old fucker. Don't know. <clears throat> we just. Yeah. Do, we could just do like I say, fill another twenty minutes of just, just fucking, just voices. Maybe we haven't done a lower low yet. We haven't done, yeah. Uh, you know, as long as we yeah. haven't done, we haven't done step to and son. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Oh, yeah, that, that was a big hit we last week. Arthur so. Fowler. Oh, got a break honey, I am the grandmother from the bed. I have been here for twenty five years. <laughs> and cool. still the British police officers are in the fucking cupboard. Who is this, John Sweet? You are trying to cut into the boat with me, Renee. I'm going to have 40 wanks. Renee, I bang the stick on the floor for 25 minutes. (laughs) Just, I mean... (laughs) Lights at the end of the bed. This is pretty German. You have been watching. I miss those days. Oh, <laughs> What's he doing? Oh, fuck me. Hmm. Great. That's filled up again. <clears throat> Another two and a half. Two oh, and a half. Yeah, minutes. easy. Easy. They're, they're paying for a call for good, it, haven't yeah. we? Yeah, yeah. I mean, that's it. I mean, you for me, it's just a way of just... 
I mean, yeah, if they're willing to pay for it, I'll do, I do, you know, I do three hours a week, but uh, so far, <clears throat> it's, it's, no. it hasn't happened. No. Just yet. No. Just give them less. But, uh, That's what we should start doing. We'll just give them like one free one and then we'll charge one prick for another one. Yeah. There we go. There's a hot Who's topic of debate. Are you a listener? Oh, that's the thing, isn't it? Yeah. Do you know what? People pay yeah. for this. I think less of them. I think. I think. I think. <laughs> I don't lo- know if you remember. I think lowly enough of them now, to be honest. Well, there was talk a, a little while ago about us trying to raise. Was it 1.5 million? Yeah. And what we were going to do is get a na- naughty boy scooter. Yeah. I was going to tie it. Was it to your nipples, tie the string to your nipple, and then drive off and rip one of the nipples off for one point five million? Yeah, we, do, we could rebirth that idea. You know, yeah. if, they didn't go for it. Went to a crowdfunder. No, crowdfunder is is that's the one, really, isn't it? You know, I could try it. Um, Stick it on there. What? Yeah, <clears throat> we'll do. You know, we we'll do a normal podcast, then we will just do one of just just the voices and the and the fart noises. No, absolutely. I mean, there's no context here now, but nothing. <clears throat> absolutely yeah. nothing. No. I, think that's I, th- I, I, I like good. this new version where we, we, we drink th- all the way through it as well. It's quite, quite good fun. <laughs> so I don't get a chance to drink these days. You know, I don't get a chance to drink these days. This is uh, that's the beauty of it. Beef it up a bit. Yeah. Yeah. I'm going to can a Heineken. Mm. If you're a listener and you're drinking at the moment, well, what are you having? Smash, you know, smash, I'm having yeah, Heineken. Yes, like a subscriber if you're having a drink. Or, mm. if, or if you're not having a drink. Yeah, there you not. go. Smash like and subscribe if you're having a drink, whether it's uh, alcohol or soft drink. Yeah. Or if Again, it, it will drive some content. It will drive some content towards the uh, the sort of the social networks. Yeah. I think I can do Should like we a, mention them? I'll do like an unboxing episode. I think we'll just I'll just open shit on the YouTube channel. Perfect. Yeah. Yeah. I could do that. Um, yeah. Get the hello hello box set. Yeah. Unbox that. Yeah. Then a film of yourself watching it, so you've got a, a reaction video of that. Yeah, they're good though. Isn't they? Those reaction videos on YouTube, classic, brilliant, really good, brilliant. Yeah, Reese, could we? Are you still there, Reese? Reese, there. Is he he's still yeah, there? He's still there. Could, yeah. could we? Could, could we do a reaction video? We watch you saying prayers. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. I, I, how are we going to do that now? Well, well, I, don't, yeah. I don't want to piss off, you know, any any listeners. So, could you do like <clears throat> like a selection of different prayers from different faiths, and then make your own different religions and do stuff. all for that as well? Yeah, and then do like an because like, that way it's not offending. And an atheist one. Yeah, yeah. What do you um, I'm, just Goog- I'm just googling multi faith prayer. There we go. So you can get it all done in one. Oh, yeah, perfect. I've, I've had, oh, guys, I've had a brilliant idea for content. What's that? Really yeah. good idea for content. If we make those the noise of the French grandmother in the bed with with the fart noises, mm. but it's not just me and Mike, it's Reese as well. So mm. we could do that for 20, 30 seconds. You up for this? We like to do fart noises, Reese. Yeah, yeah I'm I'm to it. Should, we, yeah. should we try it now? You are now. Okay. Go on, try it. Go on. Okay. Go. So let's go on. Okay. Oh god, it sounds like a shit is. And then can you do this? Can you do this? <laughs> oh Rene! It just means I can't not I have I have I me You want me to do that? Yeah. yeah. I still like that, anyway. Yeah. <clears throat> Yeah. <laughs> 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 All right. So no, that, that was that? really that was really good. Now job. all Thank three you of us you the job. after three. All three of us do it after three. You ready? One, two, three. <laughs> 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 yeah. Strong, strong content there. Right. Really. Yeah, cheers, Reese. No problem. Thanks, Reese. Thanks for doing that. Thanks, uh, if you need anything else, let yeah, me yeah. know. Yeah, All right. No Red problem. Force. Thank you. No problem. Nice one, love. Man. Good, uh, really good producer, there, Reese. I've got a. I've got an idea. I've got an idea for another another bit of content. Go on, uh, Mike. Uh, I'll, I'll ring you up. I'll try and sell you some. I'm going to homeschool my kids like those sad pricks on fucking YouTube, I am. 
That's what I'm going to do. Hang on. Here we go. I'm just, I'm just going to bring you. Hang on. Just give another killer. Do, 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 do. Hello. Do, do. Hello. Uh, uh, I am, I am Mike. It's, uh, it's Carl Zambaduce here. You, you don't know me, but uh, I got your number through a friend who's got a database oh. of all call numbers and oh, all that. Yeah. I'm just ringing up. Yeah, like- well, I don't know if you're familiar, but I, I'm from the Zappaducci's. You know, we runs a toilet shop in town. We got a chain of fucking restaurants and all that. But we're just, what I want it is, Mike, we're yeah, branching yeah, right. out into u- unique uh, staycation holidays after the fucking COVID situation. A lot of people are staying at home at the moment, but we we got a series of fucking luxury developments around the UK, ranging from a fucking bath in fucking Hull, like right through to a fucking shed in well, fucking... Like, yeah, it sounds fucking, fucking smart as fuck, mate. Go on, yeah. It's, it's wicked, it is. So what we're doing, we're currently offering people uh, for £3.60 a night, you get right, a chance yeah. to stay in our luxury family accommodation. It is with a fucking bath and it's got a fucking bedroom and it's got a fucking drawer and all fucking bread and all in a kitchen. So what we're doing, sir, Mr. Well, Mr. It's, Mr. Fucking, it's, uh, Mr. It's Bums, tidy as fuck, mate. Go on, yeah. Tidy, no, God. Sorry, mate. Go on, yeah. We're offering the opportunity for a free stay for you at the moment to stay in one of our luxury vacation villas. And you, if you just have the opportunity to leave a fucking polite response on the internet afterwards, if you're oh, interested, we've got spaces yeah, yeah, well, like, Mate, I'm up for that, mate. What do you want me to say and all that? Like, you know what I mean? All we got to do is we give you three weeks of free accommodation in our luxury bath what's just outside the fucking, uh, well, I'd be outside of Manchester, actually. And you fucking stays there for three weeks with your family, or in completely the free bath, of charge. Like, in a fucking bath with your fucking family. Yeah, and fucking actual fucking, fucking bread. bath, like, you know, not, not a fucking bath, fucking room, like, not bath the place, you mean a fucking bath, like... <laughs> A fucking wash tub it is, like, and we fucking push you in a wash tub, but a fair dues, it ain't plugged in or nothing, it's just in a field next to where a horse does all shits and all, but it's completely free, and if you likes it, all we ask is you leave a fucking review on our fucking page, and you give Zabaduchi the benefit of the doubt that you won't die on fucking holiday. <laughs> all right, Kelly, if you're that sounds fucking sick as fuck, mate, that does, that sounds all right, mate, yeah. It's- Wicked. I've done, I've done, I've done, I've done one of them like, you know what I'm saying? No, but, 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 well, look, well, have, you, have you got a brother? Have you got a brother called don't Liam? You, I, call Liam fucking Zabba. You fucking know. You don't know fucking Liam, do you? I have fucking Liam. Went to the fucking big house a couple of years ago. Fucking, uh, thought he went to the fucking <laughs> over the fucking wall. Like, he done a fucking, was, uh, it's like a cycling fucking holiday, didn't he? I don't know what he, he, he was, was doing. All he smart as fuck, me. I was on a fucking drifter. We went all over the fucking place, mate. Up the fucking M4, up the fucking M5, M6, all the fucking M's. It was fucking tidy as fuck. It's well, the fucking thing with Liam, like, is he's fucking what he's got now. Look, he's a fucking iron horse, dirt burner, two BMX service. And if you give him 330 quid, give you the fucking BMX for the whole day, he gets to take it out in the town. He he's teaches you wheelies in the morning. As fuck, mate, he is. By the afternoon, you can go round town with a bunch of 14-year-olds and tell people to fuck off, and it's only 235 quid a day. If you're interested, I can send a number over, give him a call, we can link it up with a fucking, fucking hot bath holiday. You'll have a fucking death on my time. fucking missus. I've been fucking sopping on about it, mate. She fucking loved it. I gave her a fucking backing down the M4, mate. She was fucking loving life. Believe. Well, I fucking tell you what. If you like the sound of that, you'll fucking love my sister Lorraine. She's got a fucking makeup service at the moment. We're offering all ladies from the ages of 13 to 79. Yes. And if you have got a wife, if you have got a wife of that age or below or above who's willing to spend £450 an hour, we can invite her round to the house. We put a load of makeup in a rubber tube, then Cal puts it up in the house and pass it all over him. <laughs> Well, I'll be honest with you, Cal, I'll probably stick to the fucking bikes like me, because my missus got fucking sensitive skin and all that. <laughs> Fair dudes, like, I mean, I could understand you. your missus don't want flex of shit going on her face when she's putting makeup on, but it is a very good service, and if you keep it in mind, I'm quite sure we can sort something out. Anyway, as for the holidays, we'll book you in for next Thursday, we'll get you on the fucking BMX bike, and fingers crossed, nobody dies, you can leave a safe review, and we can all be fucking laughing this time next year as I rake it in with my fucking holiday, mate. (laughs) 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 Thanks, girl. (laughs) No worries, I gotta go now, mate. I got a fucking problem with my inner fight.
Oh, when I say in a fire, I mean anus. I can't get nothing out. It smells like a pet shop when they sell the dry pig ears down there. <laughs> Class show today, oh, my dear. Yeah, Fifty-four minutes in. I'm a bit scared. I think there was a bit. I mean, we're nearing. Spooky for me. It's a bit too paranormal. <laughs> I know, we've gone nuts on the uh, paranormal. I, I mean, I've, I, as I said, a paranormal is AF this week as well. Uh, Reese, how are we doing for time, We're Reese? Time there, Reese so. there you go. you got like a little bit of time to do some paranormal stuff if, 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 you, if you want. This, sorry, the, the line is breaking You've up a bit. Up Could you say that again in, in the style of the... Could you say in the style of the French grandmother from Hello, Hello, as she passes wind? <laughs> oh, oh, no, oh, it's five minutes for paranormal, <laughs> shit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, oh god. Yeah. Oh yeah. This is good. There we go. <sighs> Spook better. Let it calm down a little bit for the night now. Do you just want to do step two and stand instead of paranormal? Should, should we eat for the last five minutes? Yeah. We could do. Can we? No. Yeah, all right. I'm, I just have a bit of drink. Oh, I'll have a sip of this a minute. It's nice, isn't it? <sighs> It's better. Oh, oh, God. Much better. Oh, oh dear. So we do, should we start with a theme tune to... Uh... Oh, you want to do? Bring, 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 or uh, sound of the audience clapping. Hang on. Opening scene, living room. I put my, my candle, I'll do a clap noise. Hang on. Okay. Opening scene, living room, uh, step toes in the bath, uh, legs up, rubber tube coming out. <laughs> <laughs> Enter uh, Wilfred Bramble. Harold. Yeah, well, Wilfred Bramble's, Bramble's, in the, in the Bramble's in with his legs up, is he? Bramble's in the bath. Harry and then, and then Harold. What's Corbett doing? Comes in. Door slammed. Oh, oh my God. What the hell have you done to that rubber tube, you horrible, dirty pervert? Oh, Errol, Errol, you've got to help me, Errol. I'm in a terrible fall. I was trying to change the life, old Merrill. You wouldn't believe it, but I fell over and I've got a big rubber tube up me and I've got a can of beans that's gone up me and I'm trying to swallow it daily in a cup. You horrible bastard. You do I was saving those bees for dinner. You do I was, you fucking piece of scum. I was saving those bees for dinner and you pop them up your bum with a fucking tube, you fucking slime. Oh, well, please, Adel. I didn't mean to do it. I just fancied a nice hot bath and fancied a nice tin of beans to go with it, Adel. <laughs> oh, you make me sick. You finally eat my fucking beans. That's the dirty old man. It's all the same if I left my computer on. Oh, I'll yeah. end up getting arrested for the things you left. <laughs> Adult, you, everybody knows you can't get arrested for looking at a zebra dick on the internet, Adult. <laughs> you dirty pervert. What did you think happened last week when the police came out? They arrested you for looking at that picture of a zonkey dick, you fucking horrible pervert. <laughs> Adult, please, Adult, I'm out on bail. If they catch me again, I'll go down for life. And I'm about 95 as it is. <laughs> I'll let you suck one of my fingerless gloves, Adult, how about that? Oh, dear, you try to force me to suck your fingerless gloves. 
Ground floor for fuel and stationware and other goods. <laughs> Wit and haberdashery. Kitchenware and food going up. First floor, telephone, gents, ready made suits. Shirts, socks, ties. The wears and shoes going up. Anyway. Well, that's, that's 15. Yeah, that's, 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 uh, well, you can kind of wrap it up if you want. Is it sorry, real? sorry, you, you're breaking up a bit there. Could you could you just say that again in the style of the French grandmother from Hello, Hello? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> if you want. René, he said that we only have roughly a minute left in the game. Ground floor, perfumery, stationery and leather goods. Wigs and haberdashery, kitchenware and food going up. First floor, telephone, gents, ready-made suits. Shirts, socks, ties, hats, underwear and shoes going up. So we, we just fade it out there. Well, you're just talking about which, what, what uh, like paranormal stuff do you want to talk about? Oh, all right, very quickly before we end up. I was, uh, have you heard of Todd Morden in uh, Yorkshire? No, can they, can, can they, listeners Google it? Can they Google that for themselves? Yeah, 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 Google that. Todd. Google Todd Morden, Yorkshire. Oh, you Todd it? Morden, it's a place, uh, T-O-D-M-O-R-D-N, Todd Morden. T-O-D-M-O-R-D-N? Yorkshire. Todd Morden, yeah, T- Todd Morden. You're missing a vowel there, aren't you? Todd Morden, Todd Morden. T-O-D-M-O-R-D-E-N? Yeah. T O D M O R. And is that like yeah. paranormal stuff, is it? Well, this is the crux of it. Well, I was in Todd it. Morden. Just, just, just a yes or no. Uh, yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah basically, well, yeah. Let, them, let them Google it and they can draw their own conclusions, can't yeah. they? Yeah. All right, wicked. There you go. Okay. Um, Reese, I'd just like to hear you maybe say goodbye. Uh, tune in next week and follow um, uh, Demon Seed Pod on Twitter in uh. the of the French Grandmother. And I, I think we're done. Oh, yeah. I know. Oh. It's you next time. Oh. And black oh. next time. Oh. And Peter. Oh. René. Oh. How can René. you get out of the bed? Oh, René, um, you fool. Yeah. Oh. Oh. oh, René. René. Oh. And also, yeah. if, they want to re- if they want to review the show, oh. Oh. it helps. Oh yeah, well just tell them straight for that. Go- bit. Listen, you fucking. Okay, nuts. yeah, yeah. Just, on, yeah. just review the show. Yeah, because it's got an Apple Podcast. Or something. If you're on Apple Podcast, yeah, yeah. Um, well, if if you're on forty, well, if I think it only that. works to to get to. Oh, fuck on it. Apple, just write. It? If you if you're not on Apple Podcasts, write yeah. down a review on a bit of paper. Take mm. a photograph, put it on Twitter. Show us that. That'll do. There fuck it. That'll do. Get it off. Turn it off. I want to go and do something else now. Yeah. Don't play me. Yeah. Good call. Press stop. Goodbye. The Demon Sea. Walk up. You must be mistaken. It's now. It's here. The man down here and help us. Demon Sea. Paranormal existence. You mean to say you came here purposely? The first move in the great conspiracy had been made. 